time for Fisher Brad to show you how to put the reel in motion with the poles and the camera while recording fish approaching. Got the nickname growing up. It was chosen by the hometown folks when noticing his devotion. Traveling from small creek to the biggest ocean. He'll be catching every monster and feeling thrilled emotions. Whether it's summer or whenever water is frozen, he's always holding trophies up and getting vids posted. Hey guys, it's the Fisher Brad, and in today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to bottom fish for lake trout, burbot, catfish, and a variety of other species. Before I get into the fishing content, I want to mention my guide service. Currently, we have been crushing the lake trout, but the last two days have been slower. We have been consistently getting good bites on steelhead and Atlantic salmon through the ice and open water. So if you're interested in booking a trip, please call or text me at 586-719-8935, and if you call, leave a voicemail. My favorite bottom fishing rod is made by Anderson's Pro Bait. This is the Anderson's Slide Liner. This is a six foot six, medium heavy. It's rated 15 to 50 pounds. You can chuck two pound weights with this. However, for this rig, we are using a six ounce pyramid weight. For my favorite bottom fishing rig, I use a Bass Pro Shops crappie rig, and then I replace them with a size two Bass Pro Shop hook. For still fishing, my most favorite bait to use is dead bait. I love using shad, or also, if you catch a lot of fish, you can keep the carcasses. And I like using the pieces of filet that are left over, like the skin, and you cut into chunks. That will work very well. Normally, I wait for a fish to make a full commitment. If I see a tiny dean in a bell, I normally wait for a second dean or to see the rod bend over before I grab it and set the hook. This will ensure that the fish swallows the bait instead of spitting it out, and then me setting the hook and the fish swimming away. I kept them on, so I'll leave it right there. And then, uh, since I don't have a rod holder, I'm going to put the line tight, turn it around, like right there. Now I'm going to put my bell on. You're not going to have to worry about that because you have a rod holder. But if you didn't have a rod holder, this is what you would do. We're then going to put this around here. And we're going to tie it to about... Like right there. And this just goes right in there. And now if this is me, what I would do, because this is by myself, right? If I didn't have anybody to, right. to help. Like yesterday when I had to grab it, because it was like going that, like the, the rod it pulled this way and it just kept trying to go that way. So I grabbed it, pushed up, and I held it really, like I had my one hand above that reel, put it against my waist, and I hurried up and it was, because uh, yeah. I was, you know, it was heat of the moment. You had to sure. do what you had to do because it was, it wasn't a rod holder pole. It was one of those. I heard a bell. Did you hear a bell? No. Hey, hey, right here. You got fish. Hurry up, come on, hurry up, hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Grab it, hook set, hook set, hook set, hook set. Not too far. There, real, 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 real. Still got him? Still got him? Yep. Laker? Burbot? I think it's a walleye. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. No, it's burbot. Is it? Yep. Nice Perfect. First fish. First, like, what, five minutes? Yeah. Oh, it's a baby burbot. Thank you. Got the net. Yep. Now, those burbot, if it didn't swallow it, you can unhook it. Be very careful. You want to get on a streamer because those will flop right off. That's a burbot. That's a burbot. It's, a burbot. it's a small one though. Yeah. But there's no size limit on these, and you can keep as many as you want. Oh. And they're, they say they're the best tasting fish in Michigan. Yeah, if you swallowed it. If he swallowed it. Yep. What we're gonna do? We're gonna have to cut that line. We're gonna have to cut it right here, like right there, and I'll attach you a new thing. But let, right. before I do that, let's get all these other rods out. Okay. Good. Yep. So these are smell knots. So all you're gonna do is loop that around yep. that silver like this. Yep. Yep. Pull it.
I think I got blood in my mouth from that bourbon. Oh, <laughs> All right, go ahead and uh, let's see the ray. Yeah, just don't get too close to the. Where? Right here? This one? Right here? Very last pull? No, the second to last one. Uh, yep, yep, yep. You want to grab that net? Yep. Yep. There we go. Be careful. Yep. Going down that ledge, it's just deep. Woo! Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Be careful. Coming up, okay? I don't want you falling. Let me see this. Be very careful. Don't fall. Yep. Another burbot. Awesome. Yeah. I was standing over there and I seen dog leash moving them. Yeah, I didn't I didn't even hear it. No, I didn't either. Mine didn't uh, go off either. Yeah, neither did mine. Right. Third bourbon of the day so far in like 15 minutes. Doing pretty good today. But I only have one because all the rest got snagged on rocks or so this is the ticket right here. This is the Hail Mary Mary lure. So you're gonna get your big one. I'm gonna check your drag real quick on this too. So Hold it good, and then pull your rod tip over here. So how far up you pass this? As far as you can. As far as you can. Okay. Count two, Put two. your rod tip up. Hold your up rod tip up. Tighten it like four clicks to the right. Oh, good, perfect. To the right again. You're turning it that way, right? Right. Yep. Okay. Uh, hey, bell, 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 bell. Ball one. Oh, it's big, it's big, it's big. Oh, it might be gone. Oh no, it's still on. Someone come grab the dog leash off. It's stuck. You gotta walk down, pull it out. Pull it the other way. It's wrapped around it. The line's wrapped around it. Tor tor spin it. Here, spin the dog leash. Yep, yep, keep going, keep going, keep going. Spin, spin, spin. Perfect. All right. Still on? Yep, yep, still on. Let's take a look at that other rod though now. It's on there. Oh, is that a muskie? Oh no, it's just a big burbit, I think. No, it's a laker. Here, here, give me the net. Real quick, real quick, real quick, real quick. Let's go. Hold the net again. Got it. Yep. Here, you see the net? I got it, I got it, I got it. Got him? Yep. Almost. <laughs> Big Laker. No, oh, oh, it just snapped. The line just snapped. I got him. Yep. Now hold on, I don't want to fall. Yeah, so this line snapped. So go ahead and grab this rod. Got it. Get up, it's tangled up in the next two. Okay. It might have came out though now that it snapped, you know. That's a nice that. Laker. Oh yeah, it's a smaller one. But... Exciting.
Just set it. Still on there? 